How to change password policy settings in Microsoft Windows. First, I'm going to sign in uh, in my admin account. Then right click on the start button, choose run and then type secpo.msc. This is only available in uh, Pro edition and in uh, Enterprise edition. So type secpol.msc, click OK. Then we have open local security policy. Choose account policies and password policy. Here you can change your password policy settings and enforce password history. When you right click, choose properties, hit explain, you can read what this function is about. And uh, enforce password history means, means that uh, system remember your password. When it's set to zero, Windows will not remember, will not keep your password history. But when we set it for five, system remember your last five passwords. So when next time system will ask you to change your password, you will not be able to use one of five password you have lately. Maximum password age is by default set to 42 days. It means that after you set your password, when 42 days passed, system will ask you to change it. Minimum password age is set to zero, so you can change your password immediately. If you set to one, it means that when you set your password, you can change it after one day. If you set to seven, if you set your password, you will be able to change it after a week, after seven days. Minimum password length, so how many characters. When zero is here, it means that there is no password required. So you can have your local account without any password. If it's eight, it means you have you must have at least eight characters. Password must meet complexity requirements. We can here enable or disable this function. Password complexity means that password should be at least six characters, contains uppercase, lowercase, digit, non-alphabetical characters, and so on. You can read this in explain. And the last is store passwords using reversible encryption. You can enable this or disable. That was how you change password policy settings in Microsoft Windows. Please leave a comment, visit my website itsbrick.com and thank you for watching.